Hi, this is Eva from the Electronic Frontier Foundation. Facebook recently updated their privacy settings in response to criticism from privacy organizations like EFF, as well as the criticism of privacy-conscious users. The purpose of this video is to show you how to get the most privacy out of these new settings. So, to get to the privacy controls, go to Account. Then choose Privacy Settings. If you see Choose Your Privacy Settings at the top, congratulations! You have the new privacy options. Otherwise, you will have to wait until the new rollout reaches you. Here we have three main areas. At the top is Basic Directory Information, which affects what people can see when they search for you. In the middle is Sharing on Facebook, which covers the privacy of your status posts and information on your profile. Down here we have Applications and Websites, which covers what Facebook platform apps like games and other websites like Pandora can access from your Facebook profile. There's also an option for individualized blocking of people and applications. We will start by locking down the basic directory information. Click on the View Settings link at the end of the second line. The basic directory settings control how your friends, exes, enemies, government agents, and everyone else might find you on Facebook. To lock down your account, set all of these to the maximum privacy available, friends only, except for send me friend requests, which must be friends of friends or higher. Note also that under see my friend list, your friend list is always available to applications and your connections to friends may be visible elsewhere. Click on Back to Privacy when you're done. Next, you will need to set your sharing on Facebook preferences. To maximize your privacy, click on the Friends Only tab, which will make the available settings switch to Friends Only with one more click. Facebook promises to keep these settings sticky so that future changes will default to the privacy level you select here. However, many users will want to customize to reflect their individual tastes. To customize, click on Customize Settings. This brings up a new page where each setting has individual options. You should review these settings and modify any that you would like to share more widely than friends only. At the bottom of the first section, you will see another link, Edit Album Privacy for Existing Photos. Click this to modify your photo setting on an album-by-album -album basis. Click the Back button to return to the customization page and complete your review. When finished, click Back to Privacy to return to the main page. Next, you will need to adjust your Applications and Website settings. Click on Edit Your Settings to the lower left. This brings you to the Application page, which has several submenus. First, check your Game and Application Activity setting, which should be Friends Only if you follow the instructions so far. Next, to control what happens to your information when your friends sign up for an application, click the first Edit Settings button. Then uncheck all boxes that show up. Note that your name, profile, picture, gender, networks, and user ID, along with any other information you've set to everyone, is available to friends' applications unless you turn off platform applications and websites. The next box controls instant personalization, the controversial program by which your information is shared with Yelp, Pandora, and Microsoft by default. To opt out, click Edit Settings. Scroll to the bottom and deselect the checkbox. Click Confirm. Go back to Applications. The public search setting controls when search engines like Bing or Google can find you on Facebook. Edit Settings brings up a new page. If you have followed these instructions, Enable Public Search should be off already. Back to Applications. With these settings, Platform applications can still see the information Facebook deems public – name, profile picture, gender, etc. – even if you have locked down the info accessible through your friends. To completely lock down your account, you can turn off all platform applications. However, the price is that you cannot use any platform applications, and you may lose any data held by these apps. There is currently no option to block all applications except the ones you choose. 
click on Turn off all platform applications. You will see the apps that you will lose and must select all before you can turn off platform. Congratulations! You have locked down your profile on Facebook. If you have any trouble following these instructions, please contact Facebook's technical support.